that crate today, like I said. But I have two guests with me, so I have my Uncle Les, and I have my brother, Jason. <laughs> and they're really excited to be healthy me. Super <laughs> excited, people. <laughs> Ooh, okay, so the snack crate, so it's from a different country. Every month you get a snack crate, and it's from a different country. So this snack crate is from Hawaii. See that? that would be the U.S. in case anybody doesn't know. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It's the 50th state. <laughs> that's the 50th state, that's right. Okay. So, fun facts about Hawaii. They have a fun facts book in it. Um, let's see. Snakes are outlawed in Hawaii, including all methods of transport. Did you not? Snakes? Yeah. Oh, no. I thought it was only Ireland. <laughs> Surfing was invented in Hawaii. I knew that. Oh, the people of Hawaii consume the most spam per capita in the U.S. I wonder why. I know. It's a hand-based product. They like him. And Dog the Bounty Hunter. Oh, yes. It's from yeah. Hawaii. Okay, so we get the original crate. So there's a mini, original, and then uh, family. And then you can get a drink upgrade. So I didn't get a drink upgrade. The drink upgrade was a white Kona blend coffee with milk. Okay, so we get the original. So we're gonna go through it and we're gonna test taste it for you. Now my ranking system here on my channel, <laughs> it's, it's up, it's up good. You rank it five pineapples. Five pineapples. So zero pineapples is I would never eat it again. Mm -hmm. And then five pineapples is give me the rest of the bag. So the first thing in it is Hawaiian style luau barbecue chips. Take a trip to a traditional Hawaiian feast with these Sweet and spicy barbecue chips. Should let people see what the package looks like. Maybe he should get a YouTube channel. Yeah. Okay. The potato chips, love it? Yep. Not just potato chips, blue out chips. Blue out chips. Sounds good. They're probably spicy. Not too bad. I think they're barbecue chips. Yep. I would give them four pineapples. I'm not a huge barbecue fan. How many pineapples would you bring them? Oh, four as well. I'd give it a three. Three. Why <laughs> Why give three? I just don't like the taste of it. It, it reminds me of um, Lay's barbecue chips. Though. These ones, I don't even want to try these ones. Hawaiian kettle style potato chips, but it's hula pino. I'm really not a jalapeno fired. I'm, I'm not even going to try them. You have to try them. I'll okay, try a little bit. Them the but I get really. How else are you supposed to know if you like them or not? Yeah, but I don't. I'm not a spicy it's kind of girl. It's not going to be that hot. Like less no, Take a less dumpy. No, it's a small one. That's good enough. That's not that bad. Better than the uh, barbecue. Mm. Yeah, those taste way better yeah. than barbecue. They're not even spicy, really. I give those five. Four, another them. four. I give four. Yeah, those are really good. I like those ones. Okay, these are Maui onion flavored potato chips. Well, I like those before you open the bag. Yeah. Crunchy chips infused with savory onion flavor and dusted with salt. Makes you feel the mouth is Do you ever go to Hawaii? No. Uh, the farthest west I've been is to California. I like them. I would give those five. Yep. Yeah. I know. Also five. Too good. Onion flavor. I think they're good. They're not as oniony as our own. No. They're more real. I can give, give it a three. Ooh, I don't really care for that. You're a herd man. <laughs> okay, this is caramel corn Hawaiian style tropical pineapple and coconut. Is it dried? Well, obviously, it's not fresh pineapple in there. I, know that. I would think. Ooh, getting into the candy. Oh, okay, just one sec. I'm gonna get pieces of pineapple too. Mmm, mmm. It's 
caramel corn. Mm-hmm. Make sure you get the spider one. Mmm. Five times five pineapples. Mmm. Really good. It's really different. A dried pineapple. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's good it? though, isn't it? Yeah. I give it 25 pineapples, even though it said five. But oh. you don't like pineapples. How much sugar in it? 13 grams for 28 gram serving size. A lot of sugar. And how much, how big is a bag? 57 grams, so half a bag, 13 grams of sugar. That's quite a bit. It's a not, not, not very good for diabetics. It's a caramel. No, oh, yes. Mm. I give that, I give that three. I didn't care for it. I give it a 25. What did you give it? I gave it a five, but actually. Really good. Hawaii cookies candy bread. What does it say about this? Dotted with colorful sprinkles and flavored with a hint of lemon. A little mystery's kind of like more. We'll save some for him. My nephew, my brother's son. He'll love them. Oh, and there's not really that many. Okay, so we'll have to save the rest for him. We'll take one each. What are the cookies? Mm-hmm. Oh, they remind me of one. They look like birthday cake. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. No? It doesn't do anything for me. A tree. <laughs> it's kind of dry. Very dry. Mm. Mm-hmm. It reminds me of um. Remind me of the cookies from McDonald's. I was just gonna say that. Except that's birthday cake flavor almost, like mm. the sprinkles. I like them. I give it a three as well. Five. I find them too dry. Five. This no is making me thirsty. <laughs> so we didn't get the try the coffee that's on that list and you didn't get the coffee? No, because I didn't upgrade yeah. the... Um, I would have told you straight if the coffee sucked or not. It's a Kona blend. And what is this? There's just one of these, so we each have to take a little piece. What is it? It looks like some kind of pastry. Yeah, it does look like a little piece. Looks like a cookie. Cookie. It is, oh, a Piaka Pineapple Shortbread. This authentically Hawaiian treat is made of all native ingredients featuring sweet shortbread with a real pineapple filling. Oh, oh. I'm not going to like that. Oh, yeah, I, I, I like pineapple. Yeah, dude. I'm the lesson you made like that. I don't like it. Do like it. have a little piece of the center. It looks like a fig newton. Oh, yeah, it looks like a fig newton. You have to try a little piece. It's obviously it real. It definitely smells like uh, pineapple. It's obviously real pineapple. Again, it's quite dry, but I, I would give it a four. It tastes like a shortbread stuffed with. And I think yeah. the filling's kind of so so. I'm going to go with a two on that one. I'd probably give it a three. Three and a half. So I already did mine. Three. Oh. I don't care for pineapple, so it's getting real little hard for me. Ooh. Okay, well, here's some coffee. That's what I was wondering. The pretz. Hawaii pretz. Kona coffee biscuit sticks. Mm, that's this one. Crunchy and sweet treat features the bold Hawaiian flavors of rich Kona coffee. Oh, that's what I was thinking that you didn't get. I thought that was actually coffee. Huh. Well, no, it comes with, like, if you upgrade the drink option, right. except upgrading the drink option is $5.99. And by the way, the customer service is really good at snack rate. We'll get back to you really quickly, and they give you refunds really quickly as well. Oh! Weird. Is that actually coffee? They look like pyramid sticks, except really skinny. Mm. Ones, right? Don't turn me on. Ooh. Oh, it smells delicious. That smells like delicious coffee. Yeah, it just looks like a, a shortbread. Mmm, but coffee flavor. The co- coffee flavor, yeah. It's that. different. I give that a four. It's weird. Yeah, but it's a nice thing. If you were having coffee with it, it would taste delicious, I think. Mm-hmm. Right? So. Something different. You won't see it around here. But you don't really drink coffee. No. Not a coffee drinker. All right. Next is pineapple gummies. Do you just want to break a piece of one? Yes. No. Do they come in a package it's so that you can know how much you should be able to take as a diabetic? No. No. I guarantee you they're 
for sure. I wouldn't take a big piece on those. No. Yeah, that's good. Well, you know, it's quite good though. Is it? Mmm. Mmm. Very good. I give that a five. Four. I go four. I like. And then, these are those rainbow carpets, rainbow belts. I wonder if they're like the dollar store ones. Oh, the rainbow walks sit on those right too. Oh, Lord. I love that. Oops. Okay. No, we're not eating that off for. This is a candy as well? Mm-hmm. It's a rainbow carpet. No, I don't particularly like that. No. I'm gonna get that one. That'd be two. That tastes nasty. It tastes like somebody soaked in their underwear in like rotten juice or something. <laughs> that tastes nasty. I wouldn't feed that to a dog. It doesn't taste good at all. It doesn't even taste as good as the ones at the dollar. I can't even finish that. Put that back. Mm -hmm. well, we put it on the bag. Gross. All right. Friends, I need a drink or something now. Okay, these it's things. almost like soap in my mouth now. What are these? I don't know. They look like a jelly filled something. Plum here. Lee Hing Mui Mui Drops M U I Sweetheart candies flavored with plums with a pit of a real plum in the center. That's kind of interesting. Holy cow! You can't get a thing off. They're sticky, really sticky. Yeah. You don't have to eat it all. Just give it a suck. It's a pit. It's a plum pit. No. No offense to anybody that's so offended out there, it tastes like ass, in my opinion. That's gross. It's got salt in it. It's in the center. Mm. I don't like it. But probably because someone already ate the plum. It's good as the pit. That's what it tastes like. That's why I said that. It's the pit that's salty. The salt it's is like all right. That's what the best part of it. Yeah, I couldn't eat that. I had to get that out. That's weird. Okay. I just put mine on the wrapper, Uncle Les. We can throw it out after. Yeah. And then, uh, I was really hoping we have the special Hawaii high chew. But we have, did you say it? A kai berry? A sai. A sai berry. High chews. I love high chew. They're like bonkers. Do you remember bonkers? No. Do you remember no. bonkers? Do you Chibi candy yeah. that has the uh, has the darker center. So they send it to different countries. So for example, like you could get um, Turkey, the country of Turkey. Yes. And they send you a whole back a bunch of snacks from Turkey. This is a gum. No. No. It's a chewy candy. It's not a candy. candy. You probably only want a tiny little bite of it. You don't want to eat it all. Mm. It's more like a toffee. Mm hmm Definitely. It smells nice. Yeah, it does. Definitely mm. another 25. That's oh. actually one of the nicest ones we've had. For candy, that would be my favorite. Mm. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I give that a five. Another five. Yeah. So the ones that get good marks are the high two, the pretz. Yeah. Uh, the One onion. of the chips, or two of the chips. Oh yeah, the onion chips. And the oh, jalapeno chips. Hulapino. 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 And then the caramel. And the caramel pineapple corn. Yeah. Yeah. Those are the highest. Mm-hmm. 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 And the caramel pineapple corn. Those are the highest. Mm-hmm. I would definitely eat those again. Yeah. But it's kind of fun to get that in your uh, mailbox. There's a disc. Um, so that's our reviews. So overall, what would you give this whole box? Out of, out, of out of what? Out of five? Five Three and a half. So yeah. Tell. I go I go three or three and a half. I, was, there was a good mix of stuff that was good, but some of the stuff, the candy side of stuff, no, not that great. 
I'd give it a four because it kind of provided a little bit of excitement as well. Um, I will include a link down below where you can get a discount if you want to order a snack crate. And thanks for watching my channel, and I'll see you again soon. Bye. That was really good. Now, how much did this cost? Uh, $39.99 if you ordered it. And you get one of everything. Yep. Same as what you got. Yep.